Aloha everyone, this is our day one video with the Amazfit GTR Mini. Today the things we're going to talk about is replacing the watch band, the band size, also going to talk about connection issues, navigation, and watch faces. So all of that in this video. And if you have any questions about this device, go ahead and leave us a comment down below. Let's go ahead and jump right in and get started. First up, let's go ahead and replace the watch band. To replace the watch band, just flip to the back and you'll see the metal prong here along the band. What you want to do is pull this notch towards the middle. So you can either pull this up or pull this one down. So for me, it's easier to just pull down and remove. So you just pull that down and remove. And to do it the other side, it's easier for me to just flip it over and repeat the process. This uses a 20 millimeter watch band, which is the same as the Galaxy Watch 5 Pro and the 5 Series. So I'll just remove this here, same way. And to put the watch band on, go ahead and put the opposite end of the lever. And once that's aligned, just pull down and it'll snap into place. So that's replacing the band and also watch size, which is 20 millimeter. Now let's go ahead and talk connection issues. So when you swipe down, I see this a lot, and that means that this is not paired with the watch, which means you're not getting notifications and it's not also syncing with the application. I have this synced with my Samsung Galaxy Z Flip 4, and I don't have any battery restrictions, so I shouldn't be having connection issues. However, if you want to sync it, you're going to have to go ahead and open up the ZEP application, and now it'll connect and sync. All right, so it has just connected and sync. So here's my step data and my sleep data from yesterday. So if you're looking to get notifications, I wouldn't suggest this smartwatch because since it didn't sync all day today, I didn't receive any notifications, emails, text messages, and stuff like that. But on the opposite end of that, it does have great battery life. So I'm at 92% and we did the unboxing two days ago. So if you want to sync, make sure you open up the app. And you'll see the icon change here. That means that is connected and now we will get notifications. All right, next part of this video is navigation. So just a quick overview on how to navigate the smartwatch. So just swipe down to access your settings. To go back, you can either swipe up or you can push the home button. If you swipe left or if you swipe right, these are your widgets. And this will go all the way around until you're back to the home page. When you're at a widget, if you swipe up and down, it won't take you to the notifications or the quick settings. So if you wanna check your quick settings, you have to tap home and you can access your quick settings. And if you swipe up, that's your notifications. So again, when you're in widgets, you won't be able to access either one. Make sure you press the home button and then from there, you can go ahead and access your notification and your quick settings. All right, and the final part of this video, let's go over watch faces. The easiest way to do this is go ahead and open up your ZEP application, tap on your watch on the upper left, and here go ahead and select watch faces. From here, you can download all the different watch faces, and the ones here in the store are free. So I'll just pause once I swipe so you can take a quick look at the different watch faces. So some of these have this little tab that says more, and you can scroll down and see more of that pet, diamond, fruit, star, that's the one I currently have, paper cuttings, peaceful time. All right, let me go ahead and just select this. To change it, you're going to have to confirm and tap on sync. It downloads the face and then it will sync to the watch. All right, and we got the confirmation synced successfully, and now we have our new watch face. Hopefully I didn't go too fast, but that's our day one video with the Amazfit GTR Mini. So we went over navigation, watch faces, switching out the band. I think that's all of it. <laughs> if you guys have any questions, leave us a comment down below. Thank you guys for watching. Aloha.